Who is the most powerful person in the world? Who wields power over two billion people and has proven influence over elections and public opinion? Who also manufactures and traffics in one of the most addictive drugs known to mankind, increasing teen depression worldwide? The Zuck, the most powerful man in the world who doesn't have his finger on a button. All the hype around changing the Facebook news feed to favor content from friends as a gesture towards restoring democracy is just a big head fake. The Zuck would never do anything that doesn't turn a profit. Facebook has assembled the largest community in the history of mankind. And the individual overseeing this community screwed over his friends in college, then f over his best friend right after college, and spoiler alert, isn't concerned with the condition of our souls or national defense. A loser teens. Recent research reveals that teens aren't hanging out in person or going to parties. In fact, the number of teens who get together every day has been cut in half in the last 15 years. The culprit, once again, Facebook and other social platforms. You can't buy cigarettes or vote until you're 18 or drink until you're 21. Why should we let our kids have access to these platforms at age 13? Please respond to me in the comments. Age-gating social media, no Facebook or Instagram accounts until you're 18. Good or bad idea? An unlikely winner from Apple's iPhone success, Samsung. The Korean tech giant is the only supplier for the iPhone X OLED screen. Samsung expects to sell to Apple about 200 million iPhone screens in 18, generating more than 20 billion in revenue. That's almost half Samsung's Q3 revenue and the equivalent of selling 20 million of their Galaxy Note 8 phones. To mark the national spelling bee, Google broke down America's most misspelled words by state. Separately, Walmart released a list of its top selling items in every state, which may or may not explain some of the spelling challenges. Sweeping across the country, in California where I'm from, beautiful is the most misspelled word, and protein powder is the best selling Walmart item. People in Wisconsin apparently can't spell Wisconsin, but the Green Bay Packers bath mat is the best selling item on the Bentonville Giants site. And in New Hampshire, the most misspelled word of 2016 was diarrhea, and the best selling item at Walmart is cinnamon flavored toothpaste. Things were much easier when I was a kid. We only had 25 letters in the alphabet. Nobody knew why. We'll see you next week.